Hello and welcome to a new scroller box video. In this video I'm actually opening three scroller boxes. So I've got January's which I recorded and then I didn't make a video out of it and I've just received February's so I'm going to be opening that one as well and I also have one from last year that I didn't open. It was August last year so there's that one. And then I've also got a bonus box from last year that I didn't open. It's not a scroller box, it's an artful box. So if you stick till the end of the video and you're interested in seeing what's in that one, I'm going to be opening that as well. So I'm starting with the January box. So we've got a little sweet choco mint praline. And we've got some Tombow markers. I've never had any of these before. Tombow ABT Pro markers or the brush markers. So it doesn't seem to give you a colour name. Um, so they're alcohol markers and it's a brush tip. And the other end is a chisel tip. So that's it looks like it's in some like a light green colour. And then we've got a grey colour. I'm not big on markers, by the way, but at least they are brush markers. A lot of markers are just chisel tips. Um, and I have always fancied trying these Tombow ones, to be honest with you. And we've got like a blue colour. Um, we've got this absolutely gorgeous pencil. Oh, it's a black wing. Oh, it's a, it's a special edition scroller block. It's a special edition scroller box one. Yeah, we've had a couple of these in the past. So these are like really, really high end graphic pencils. And this one is just absolutely beautiful. It's even got a blue eraser on the end to match. That is gorgeous. And... And we've got another fine liner. It's a Zig Millennium 03. No doubt it'll be black. Tiny little nib. Not, not sure if it's waterproof. It doesn't, it doesn't actually say so. So it's probably not waterproof. Uh, we've also got a refresher suite. So that's two suites we've got. Then there's the Scroller zine, the January scroller zine. Information on all the contents. I always love looking at this page, which is artwork that other people have made from previous boxes. So this was from the November box, which was the, oh yeah, the Derwent Graffiti Tint Paint Set. Look at these beautiful pictures that people have done. Absolutely lovely. Okay. Then we've got a beautiful art print and that is by Chris Lambert and that is all his information if you want to read it. And we've got a book of Claire Fontaine paper. So I'm not really sure what that kind of paper is. Just have a look. So it's thick bleed proof paper. Use this mini sketchbook to fill with doodles and don't be afraid to use both sides. It won't bleed, it won't bleed through. All right, okay. So, oh, so it's basically like um, a doodle art. So probably the scroller challenge, which I don't normally do. Let's try and find out what the scroller challenge is. <sighs> oh, so the scroller challenge is Paisley patterns because the but they're giving you some information in the scroller zine about creating paisley patterns and look at this beautiful pattern here okay so now the february box oh i know what this is so this is, a st we've got two stickers this month. Oh, I think one of the stickers must be from the previous box because it was missing. And we've got three packets of this 
abstract acrylic paint by Sennelier. So we've got three colours. I've already had some of this in the, uh, this was in the upgrade box a few months ago and I really liked it. And I've got three more colours, so that's good. So we've got cadmium red deep hue, titanium white, and I think the other, the other one had a white in, so that's two whites, which is good because you always use more white. And um, indigo blue, that's good. We've got this multicolored pencil by Co I Know. Oh, it's one of the Co I Know magic pencils. We've got a Pro Art, a Pro Art number six round paintbrush. That looks nice, Pro Art, that's a good brand. We've got an acrylic marker. Acrylic paint marker by Dale Rowney. Looks like it's black, that's the nib. Yeah, it looks black. But I can't find a colour name on it. We've got a little packet of popping candy. Scroll is in with all the information about the items and more information about the artist who created the art print and that's the art print this month. Really, really lovely. And it's Julian Reynaud and that's his information. We've got some tips on using the paints. Some artwork from previous boxes, just some more information there and then we've also got a pad of paper, so it's the Dale Rowney System 3 Acrylic Paper Heavyweight, that's nice, it's got a, um, so it looks like it's actually canvas, that's the texture on the paper. So this is the third scroller box and then this is the bonus box that I'm going to open. I know what's in it, I've had it quite a while. It's from last year, yeah, it's from last year. These are both from last year but I just haven't opened them yet because I already know what's in them. So I thought why don't I just get them all open in the same video. Okay, so it's acrylic, acrylic paint. Um, I knew it was acrylic paint, and that's why I wanted to open, and that's what made me decide to open it because the other one was acrylic paint, and I thought I still haven't opened that other one with acrylic paint. So it's System Three Heavy Body Acrylic by Dale Rowney, and we've got a lemon yellow, a process blue, and a process magenta. We've also got another paintbrush, Pro Art number seven. That's a round number seven, but this one has golden bristles. There's a Faber Castell 2B pencil. I've heard they're really good quality. So another graphite pencil. We've got a Anglo Bubbly, which are like just so 1980s. We used to get these in the 80s when we were kids. Scroller box sticker. Scroll up, the, oh, it's like a, um, um, a plastic card to use. It's like a tool to use with the paint. And the scroll is in the art print, which is absolutely beautiful. Really, really nice. By Bastien Marianne. And that's the information for the artist. And three art boards for acrylic paint. It's got this. Texture on just like the acrylic pad, only this is obviously a lot thicker. So that's a great box. And the the challenge was facial topography. Okay, so that's that box. And then we've got this artful box. Like, look at that beautiful, beautiful pattern. So this is this one's from I think September last year. I think it is. Yeah, I think this is that these ones are every three months if you don't already know that and I think this one is from September. So. 
Okay, so this is block printing materials. Now I did do a video a few years ago um, on block printing because I got, it was a subscription box called Art and Parcel and I got this kind of stuff in that um, and didn't have a clue what I was doing. And I've always fancied um, having another go. So we've got two inks a red and a black we've got a ruler which and it's kind of it's tilted as well if you see the handles like tilted I don't know if it's supposed to be it's tilted so it's kind of more comfortable to use then we've got some these are the blades and the little handle to put the blade in and there's two, three um, of these really soft linos to cut out. Now the last one that I tried, the lino was a lot stiffer than this. We've got a sheet of acetate and we've got a pad of paper. So this is cartridge paper, premium heavyweight cartridge paper. And we've got the Artful magazine, which is really useful with all sorts of tips and tricks and tutorials. So that's a brilliant. So that's that box. And I've actually bought some more colours of this as well. So I'm going to be trying this at some point in a future video. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thank you very much for watching.